Welcome back everybody from Storm Team 10 on this Friday night where it's been a I would say blustery day. I, you know, I guess it's okay to use that term uh, because, you know, it's, it's chilly and it's windy and we've also had some spotty areas of rain. And once again, check this out. See uh, the motion of this rain. It's not often that we see this happen. Uh, this is due in part to Hurricane Joaquin, which is out in the ocean, but also a center of low pressure, which is down in the Carolinas. And so they put those two together and you've got one feeding into the other and that puts in moisture into our region. Well, take a look at the Storm Team 10 storm tracker and you can see here some areas of light rain. So if you are headed out tonight to the ball games or you just want to go out and, and do some things, uh, you'll certainly want to have something that's going to keep you somewhat warm. Uh, we have some rain in Sullivan County, uh, Southern uh, Clay County over here in Owen County, Green County down into Davies and Martin counties and also just a little bit of rain here in Knox County as well. Not so much over here in Illinois, uh, at least not quite yet, but still everybody will have the possibility to get some rain as we get into the weekend. There's not a great, great chance of rain, but it's just enough to let you know that it's possible we could have a little rain. Don't cancel your plans. 60 degrees is the current temperature. Uh, Linton has 59, Robinson 62, Vincennes 63, 59 Rockville, 65 in Mattoon, and 66 uh, over in Effingham. Dew points 43, 43, 49 in Rockville, 48 in Casey. And so still the dew points are fairly low, but they're a little higher than what they have been. But here's the thing, look at this. Uh, wind at 17 miles per hour, Robinson 21, Vincennes 18, Paris Fort, that's steady wind, and Mattoon 23, oh yes, and the wind has been gusty as well, 23 in Terre Haute, 24 Rockville, 25 in Robinson, and Vincennes 29, so it's going to be one of those nights, and a little bit of uh, light rain certainly is possible. No big storms or anything like that, I don't believe, but a little light rain is possible as we head not only into tonight, but into the day tomorrow, as you can see, and this is into tomorrow evening, and the wind is not really going to die down. Sometimes the wind calms down a little bit, but that's not going to happen for a couple of days. Allergy forecast, Saturday, slight, and Sunday, slight as well. So spotty showers, a gusty wind tonight, 49 degrees for the overnight low. Scattered showers, windy and very cool tomorrow, high tomorrow of 60. And then for tomorrow night, scattered showers again, continued windy and chilly, 50 degrees for the overnight low. And the seven day forecast, it, after this rain moves out of here on Sunday, Mike, uh, I think things are going to shape up. We get into next week and right now it looks as though we're going to warm up. We'll get a little bit of sunshine, temperatures back up into the 70s. But then again, the possibility of rain toward the end of next week.